Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening. I've been working on the video for Broken Age, and I wanted to put a little bit on the stream as I do it. Makes sense, considering if I run into any puzzles that are problematic, it makes more sense to have this chat there to say, Hey, here's how you fucking do it. It'll save me a little bit of time. Apparently the first episode's only about four hours, so it shouldn't take a huge amount. I wanted to at least get about halfway through it before I did something, and yeah, the streaming format's quite good for that, so might as well. All right, let's get on with it then, shall we? Just a moment. Just give me one second, I'm just sorting a couple of things out here. Alright, let's get into some Broken Age, shall we? And I have... Oh, there's my hotkeys, cool. They actually work, that's nice. Alright, for those of you who don't know, Broken Age is also known as Double Fine Adventure. It was one of the original Kickstarter successes for gaming, of course, by Double Fine. And originally they were asking for about $400,000 to make a 
adventure game in the style of stuff that they did previously. So you're thinking about the LucasArts age, Day of the Tentacle, Grim Fandango, Full Throttle, so on and so forth. That kind of, you know, kind of Tim Schafer stuff and obviously think about Monkey Island and all sorts of really great stuff like that. But Broken Edge comes along. They made about almost 10 times as much as what they were asking for, which allowed them to get a documentary going on the thing by, I think it was two player productions who are really, really good. I haven't actually watched the documentary yet outside of a few bits and pieces of it because I wanted to play the game and beat it first before I watched the documentary. But as it stands, about half the game's out right now. That's the weird thing about it because what they decided to do, and if Jen wants to come up and talk, she can as well. We can do that. Jeez. It's like, can't get a bit of streaming in peace. No, no. It's not a two-player game, damn it. Anyway, as I was saying, they basically ran out of money, and they released the first half of this, and they're going to use the proceeds from the first half to fund the second half. And they also raised other other funds as well, if I recall correctly. So it's a little bit of a weird situation. But let's just jump in, shall we? I say this is about 30 minutes in. I was playing a little bit last night. And there's also two characters, which is something that I don't quite understand the relationship of as of yet. But please don't tell me it's reset the game. I guess not. No, it's probably just going to pop me back to where I was. What? What do you mean? Huh? No. Oh, f what the fuck? That's my boy. It's fucking reset my save file. God damn it. Rocket? Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Okay, let me see if I can get my save file back. Oh, sorry, I'm gonna have to reload the game. I said it even showed that. It's like, hey, you know, you've, you're about 30 minutes into the game. And then it starts from the very beginning. Continue. Oh, for oh. fuck's sake. Let's try this again. Continue has now put it back to the start. It's got separate save files. I saved. I mean, you can see the save file right there. Okay, let's load from an autosave or something. No, it, it has... The fucking autosave has saved over my slot one save file. I didn't save over it. No way. I loaded from here. I didn't save. I loaded from here. This is where I was. Oh, fuck. What a waste of fucking time. This is where I was. I didn't save over it. You can't save from here. No, I didn't fucking save over it. You can't. This is where I started from. I clicked load. I clicked the thing that said 30 minutes, and then it started from the very beginning. Did No, I fucking... Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm going to go and have a look at the VOD, because I don't believe that. But this is a waste of fucking time. Give me a sec. <laughs> 